Okay, right on time. Happy Labor Day, everyone. Welcome in to D. Armstrong WLTZ. That's where you find D. TV 38, NBC, the best station on the planet, right here every day between 11.15, 11.30 or so. Usually 11.30, okay, because I am getting ready for the new news, I tell everybody. But I love getting in our Facebook live streamings and can just pat yourself. Congratulations, what an awesome audience. We're almost 13,000 uh, likes and regular people who check in, which is an awesome task to have to, uh, to, um, to do. I just want to say, let's catch up. Congratulations to everybody who won the tickets to Callaway Gardens. And they went up, up, and away in the big hot air balloon fest oh my goodness they they said thank you so much everyone for showing up it was bigger than expected check this out check this out the lines were so long for people trying to get in there and this was video was taken by our director who's back there right now nicole nikki jones and uh, she said the lines were so long girl i didn't even get a chance to get in the balloons but thank you so much for participating with our our contest and going up to callaway gardens and being a part of that uh if you have not ever if you've never done that you need to do it the other thing i want to remind you to do is i am in the songwriters associations contest i want everybody to be there on the 11th all the information is on my facebook page if you have a song and you want people from nashville and other places to hear them uh, sign up there's still some time to get in I'm gonna be doing some gospel songs that might not be your genre whatever it is I I'll take you on okay <laughs> it's on <laughs> okay cuz I want to win all right uh, as a matter of fact uh, songwriting I, I think I hear Just some singing my name I'll be there <laughs> don't you know baby yes I'll be there Oh, gosh, formerly Pink Anthem? Yeah. Oh, wow. Ladies, your names for the audience. My name is Kylie. My name is Naitiri. My name is Anali. My name is Alana. Oh, wow. Thank you so much for joining us, I tell thank you. you I let people know that you were coming over the weekend, and they have just been waiting for you. So oh, thank you so much for coming. And to see you guys growing up right there on, before our eyes on video. Yes, yes. Now, who was the baby? Oh, is that? Oh, my goodness. How old are you now? Ten. So uh, let's start from the beginning. How long have you girls been singing? Together as a group, we've been singing six years, five, six years Six now. years? Mm -hmm. Who's the first one that told your mom, who's on the other side of the camera, Mom, I think we can sing, and you need to make it happen. Who did that? <laughs> well, uh, actually, my dad. Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. What did he say? How did he know you could sing? Was it Michael Jackson? What well, were you singing to? We, we always grew up. Uh, listening to brats and the chip heads and we'd uh -huh. always pretend to be like them and uh -huh. sing and so I guess he told mommy about us singing and he thought we had a talent. So wow wow so we can your dad sing? Uh, he, he knows a good singer when he hears one. Yes. Uh -huh. Wow so how did it how so how the ball get rolling because you've been everywhere. Well we were born into uh, entertainment and yes. the arts because mm -hmm. my mom and my dad has been teaching people mm -hmm. the arts, and we were just born into it. Mm -hmm. yeah. My grandma said when I was a baby, whenever I'd listen to music, I'd always close my eyes and bop my head. So <laughs> so, oh, she can do it. So what grades are you in? I'm in 10th grade. I'm in the 8th grade. Uh -huh. I'm in 9th. Well, how is it working? Now, I had two other sisters, and it wasn't always easy. So how is it working? Four girls <laughs> coming together. Somebody's got to decide on hair, clothes, makeup, and all that. How do you make that work? We all come together and put our ideas together to 
You do? Like, okay. Yeah, that's how it's so is, so minds. does singing bring you together? Yeah. 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 Actually, Somebody yeah. could be singing in the kitchen. If we hear them, we uh -huh. all come down yeah, and join at the harmonies in it. Uh -huh. You know, it's just so do, cool. do you do this? When we're at work, they may say, D, 10 minutes to the break. And I'll go, 10 minutes to the break. You just oh, sing in yes, here. To the break. Yes. To anything's a song yes. to the break. Yes. Yes. We just start okay. singing out of the booth. Wow, and then you guys do some traditional stuff in your acapella. Yeah. You're going to do what for me right now? Mary did, you Mary, know. did you know. Mary did you know the Boykin girl? Yes, our arranger. Oh, wow. Mary, did you know, did you know that your baby boy would one day walk on water? in 10 years Ooh. like doing big things like making sure that our book is like bestseller you got a book best okay seller. yeah mm. yeah so okay good. tell oh, us this, about your book okay book, human animals uh -huh. return to triumphia first of many series uh-huh this book is about a girl a 16 year old girl named polly uh-huh who goes on a class field trip and they discover that they are the the descendants of humanos and humanos are angelic creatures they are human animals with supernatural abilities yes. and whose idea was that <laughs> <laughs> but you know what when you're young you have to have yeah. that adventure yeah. you have to have that excitement yes. that place that you can go that's not real but it's yeah. safe and it's fun mm -hmm. yeah. and that's what that is huh yeah. wow wow what is it like getting yourself prepared for something like this, going Facebook Live. We have people all over the world knowing that you, you are going to be judged by people all over the world. How much work does that take for you to prepare each day? It takes a lot. You know, we have to keep ourselves together, mm -hmm. make sure everything we do is always positive mm -hmm. and how we dress mm -hmm. and just to keep ourselves together. Yeah, we always want to put our best foot forward and, you know, try really hard in the things that we do but want to inspire people. Mm -hmm. I, I see too, there, there's a theme and your mother is, is uh, unapologetic that she loves the Lord, huh? Mm -hmm. How important is that? Because you're going into a business where a lot of it is, um, I, you know, I talked with Justin Bieber's mom before he really jumped off. She had written a book about coming out of drug addiction. Mm -hmm. And she said, I have a son named Justin and he's about to become big. And I said, are you concerned? And she said, you know, if he does lose his way, he loves the Lord. He'll come back. Yeah. So has, has your mother had that talk with you? She yeah. de First of all, she doesn't want you to go out there and have to come back. Yeah. <laughs> but what kind of talks do you have? Because you're going to say, take this off, do this, do that, drop it to the head, bring it back, and all that kind mm -hmm. of stuff. So 
and they're going to put a lot of money in front of your faces. So what do you do? God is the center of our life. We uh, make our actions based off of um, what the Bible tells us, and yeah, God comes first in our lives. Yeah, they tell us to always make sure we do the right thing. We're mm -hmm. saying the right thing. We're listening to the right thing. Stay focused. Yes. Stay positive. Mm -hmm. Our faith comes first. Stay strong. Yeah. Is that hard? Is that hard? Sometimes. What do you do? Because when you're in school, they make fun of you, don't you? I mean, my, I, my son's had the hardest time. I'm like, stay strong, stay strong. Yeah, like, definitely. Mom, you didn't give me the answer to this. And they were, because I didn't understand this about the Bible, then they say, then you don't know what you're talking about. I'm like, oh my goodness, whether you have the answer or not has nothing to do with whether it's true. <laughs> yes, Definitely. yeah. So, so how do you deal with that in school? Well, it all starts with what you're listening to and what you're, motiv uh, what you're meditating on. Mm -hmm. It'll yeah. help you, you know, with that when it comes to situations like that. Uh-huh. So, yeah. So, stay positive. Yes. So, ladies, with that in mind, what's the perfect gentleman for a boy can girl? <laughs> Someone okay. like my father. Ah, yeah, well, and, and, oh, gosh. Okay. And, and that is what? A gentleman, someone put God first in their life, uh -huh. and someone who wants to protect you, uh -huh. and someone who can teach you a few things, and you can teach them a few things so you can both go together. Oh, yeah. okay. So you see your mother teaching him some things, too? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, as well as he teaches. Yeah. And what about growing up? Didn't I read that there's seven of you guys? Uh. Yeah. Wow. How does that work? It works, I guess, for me. Like, this, we, all, we all work together. Who washes yeah. dishes? We all, we all do. do. Who has to clean the room? All <laughs> all and who has to vacuum? All you all do it? Wow. Well, I'll tell you what. You guys seem to have an awesome foundation. Uh, what, are, what are the next steps? What can we look forward to as we follow you? You're the Boykin Girls on Facebook, Mom? Mm -hmm. Okay. And where else can we follow them? Okay, all right. LABoykin.com. LABoykin.com. Yes, you'll yeah. okay. find all of our events, any social upcoming, media. Yeah, upcoming mm -hmm. events. So, so you're uh, ready to be booked? <laughs> Cause yes. That, yeah, because a lot of churches yes. in Columbus bring in a lot of people from all around. Mm -hmm. So they just get in touch with your mom, L.A. Boykin. Mm -hmm. yes. All right. Any parting words, ladies? Yes. Uh, thank you for oh, having us. Yes, thank you for having us. Oh, it's and, a pleasure. Uh, go buy the book, Humanos. It's at yes. Barnes & Noble uh -huh. nationwide. Mm -hmm. And you can get it on your Amazon and the book. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Well, any tips for me? Because you know, I've always wanted to be a boy king girl or <laughs> something like that. Chaka Khan. Beyonce. Go after your dreams. <laughs> okay. Yes. So you're saying it's never too late? No, <laughs> never too late. I, never too late. I, I got time. Yes. <laughs> okay. You just need to practice, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you so much, and you guys, thank you so much for joining mm -hmm. us every day here on WLTZ. Facebook Live, D. Armstrong. You can get in touch with them. I'll have their information posted on the Facebook page. And got a lot of cool guests coming up this week. And as always, this is your show. If there's somebody you want the community to meet, let me know. We'll try to have them on. But again, thank you so much for being with us. Hey, wait a minute. Hold on. Give them, give them, give them something. I didn't, I, I didn't even warn them this was going to happen. Just out of, you know, God said be ready in, in, in season and out of season. <laughs> Be the same without you here. I needed a I needed a chance. If only you would listen. If only you would listen. I couldn't connect. I couldn't. If only you would listen. You raised our voices. Helped us make them clear. You gave us voices. And helped us make them clear. School won't be the same without you here. <laughs> you did it, and Mom has a smile from here to here. I don't know how she's doing it, but it's all over. <laughs> okay, we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks so much for being with us.